open the hood. The handle is under the dash. Release the safety catch. It's right here. The hood prop rod is actually on the bottom of the hood. And it goes here, side of the fender. Remove the six push clips on the top of the bumper and grill. You can use a plastic prying tool. You can get this from 1aauto.com if you don't have one, or a flat bladed screwdriver. It'll work the prying tool under each side of the clip. Work it up. Slide it underneath. Basically just have to get it to unlock. That's okay if the center part comes out, you can push it back together. Take the prying tool, pry out this part. Gotta push this back together so it doesn't get lost. And remove the last clip. To remove the grill, fold it forward just slightly. You don't want to break it, just very gently fold it forward. There's a tab here and a tab here. There's two on each side. I'm actually going to squeeze them in, push them out. whole grill will pull right out of the bumper. To swap this emblem over, it's got some push tabs in here and some locking tabs in the plastic. Just gonna use a flat bladed screwdriver and very carefully pry it out. I'm gonna take a flat bladed screwdriver, push that one out, bend this one up. So I've removed our old from our grill. I'm gonna install our brand new emblem onto our new grill. It does not have any double-sided tape, just uses these push clips and a locating tab that will go into here. The push clips will go through here and these black pieces will lock them in. So once it's in there, it's pretty much in there, but it's easy to line up. I'm just gonna go like this. Gonna support it from the back a bit. Flip this over, tabs have locked in, and the emblem is installed. Install the new grill, line up these snap in clips or pins on the back. They're going to go into these holes here on the bumper. new grill clipped into the bumper. Now it's time to reinstall the push clips on the top. So these clips, these type of push clips are used in most cars and they just push in like this. And this one's all busted and broken. If you've got busted and broken ones, you can get new ones from 1aauto.com. You'll have to remove this one. And with your new push clips, they may look a little bit different, but they operate in the same exact manner. They'll go into the hole and push it. It will lock and snap in and hold things nice and tight. Reinstall the six push clips on the top of the grill and bumper. Line up the holes, push the clips in. Thanks for watching. Visit us at 1AAuto.com for quality auto parts, fast and free shipping, and the best customer service in the industry.